You notice how I'm all like burnt and I look like Rudolph? Because I went through like a box of Kleenex after all that mowing and all that fun shit. Um, so Earthlock. I have both versions. I have no idea what it is. One was games with gold and then the other one, the, this one, the new one, was I guess the like how it was supposed to be version. And um, if you owned the original one, you got this for free. So ho hopefully it's good. I think it's an RPG. The screen locks, uh, screen locks, screenshots look good. So sure, press A to start. I did it. Expert gamer. Audio seems fine for now, but uh, I guess we'll see controls. Uh, previous character, next character. Exit. Use. Confirm. Okay. Uh, audio. Okay. Uh, util. Here we go. Instant text. Sure. Uh, text speed vibration. Right. Sure, man. Star game. Hello. Helped everybody. Uh, yeah, I know. I know Eternal, but have you new helped everybody by now? Why do you still have Conan installed? Oh, I've been putting on a server for Mixer. Wow, you really have been fucking up. Always wanted to play this, never got around to it. Yeah, is this, the, this is the new one. This is apparently like how it was supposed to be. Uh, legends claim men bowed in fear and in awe of a mythic civilization that ruled across all of Umbra. Umbra? Umbrella, eh? Godlike harsh rulers who harnessed Amri. The magical energy they stored in our planet's core. There was an uprising. In the midst of a war, Umbra shook and ground to a halt. The Amri Corps burst, spilling across the lands that day and night had split in two. <clears throat> Volcanoes erupted. Tsunamis rose. And when the sea calmed, the mythic race was but a memory and Umbra was anew. And its remains, flowers and beasts were tainted by Amri for good and bad. Men and others struggled on. Soon new civilizations grew. Now, Umbra is calm. In the north, the Suvian Empire rules. But dark whispers dwell in the ruins of the old. Earthlock. Can I see your Triforce tattoo? Uh, I could show you like the Triforce part, because it's all here. And it's against terms of service to, for me to just bust out my boobies. Uh, search dungeons to find chests that contain crafting materials, ammo, talent. Okay. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mr. Diddles, what a name. Welcome to the stream, how you doing? Is this thing alive? It is alive. Why is it trying to take uh, just one more class that is the first cadet flight mission? Rough, rough. Alright. Two healing bombs, five lance. Alright. Uh, inspect. Wish you were here, Mom. Be here to welcome me back after my first scouting mission. Rip. Um, I got my slinger and power glove ready. Bring on the exam. Let's go. Before we go there, let's see what's over here. Inspect. Locked. Temporarily out of order. Is there anything over... Oh. So I, I know nothing about this game, none of the achievements or whatever. I just figured let's check it out and hope it's good. Uh, my brother is an owl and says that high owl lady Lumia seems a bit worried these moon runs. Wonder what's going on. Just one more class and some of us will be flying. Glad I studied here at the academy and not at the archive with those boring owls. Hi, Ivory. I heard you snuck into the sewer canals once. That's true? I'd be terrified. Heard so many slimy rumors about that place. This is about as far as I made it before I uninstalled, really? Yeesh. Welcome to your final combat exam, Miss Lavender. Are you nervous? Why would I be nervous, instructor? If the general's daughter failed her exam, it'd be a little embarrassing, no? Gee, thanks for bringing that up, instructor. Let's get to it. 
Story Storm Dog, you're gonna have to sit this one out. Alright, ready when you are. How's the audio, by the way, Chad? Is it too quiet? Welcome to Final Combat Training, Aive. We will start with bleh, combat abilities. Bleh, combat abilities allow you to select from a list of abilities in your current stance. Using your abilities in your bleh, uh, scout stance costs both bleh, Amri and one turn. Select bleh, combat abilities and attack the target. Yes, ma'am. I have a good fighter monitors their health closely. Items give you access to potions. Select items and use potions if your health gets low. Yes, ma'am. So I gotta do the bleh and do the, the thunder fist. It fisted, son. A uh, fire trap. Got him. <clears throat> so it's turn based. Okay. Good work. Next, you'll fight a flying creature. Remember, you will have to use range attacks to hit it. Switch stance to access range abilities. Bring out whatever you got, instructor. Ivan, this lesson we will cover stances. Stances give you different sets of combat abilities, allowing you to choose strategies depending on an enemy type. Your uh, scout stance gives you access to melee abilities. The bleh, slinger stance gives you access to ranged abilities. As you can see, I've the target is now flying and cannot be hit by a melee attack. Change to the bleh, slinger stance so you can attack the flying target. Uh, use the slinger to deal damage. Yeah. Changing stances costs one turn, allowing your enemy to attack. You can set your starting stances for the pairs menu before the combat begins. Uh, okay. Uh, so now can I lance? All right, let's do it again. You're dead. Yeah, Chris, I've I've like that sometimes. I have a game on all day and just don't touch it. <coughs> Final listen, I have combat engagement. Enemies will attempt to engage in combat if you get close enough to them, but will give up if you get too far away. The combat countdown dis uh, timer is displayed when enemies attempt to engage in combat. It shows both the number of enemies and the remaining time before combat starts. Press B to get the first turn in battle before the timer runs out or the enemies get close and strike you. The experience you gain is significantly increased by fighting more and more enemies. Be brave and bold. Gather and fight as many enemies as you dare. Approach the targets and try to engage both of them in combat. Press B to get the first turn in battle before the timer runs out or the enemies get close and strike you. On it, instructor. Come on, Taika, we got this. Take a look at this thing, huh? <clears throat> Gah! I want to hit 190k this month, but I gotta get it on my funk first. I'm just sat here staring at my games and I was trying to decide what to play. I hate that shit. I absolutely hate that shit. Uh, you know what? Let's just try. Oh, wow. Uh, bite, fire breath. Water bomb, six cents. Let's just bite him. Peace. All right. Congratulations, cadets. This marks the end of the cadet training and the beginning of hopefully some long, illustrious careers you can be proud of. General Lavender will now pronounce... Will not pronounce. Announce which pilots will be sent on their first scouting missions. This dude is in purple and white. We good, fam. We good. I guess everybody pretty much is. We good. We good. A word of caution. The scout patrol is routed along the burning coast. We lost a couple good pilots at the Goblin Camp at the Z Zabarum Temple. This mission is no walk in the park. Thank you, Instructor Vera. Listen up. The cadets that have flight clearance for this first scout mission. Punch. Judy. Sim. Iben. Commander I Ichabo will evaluate your performance, and trust me, I listen to what he says. You'll find the flight clearance documents on your desks, that will be all. Huh? Chad, I'm already hot and I've been recording for 10 minutes. I had my window open, but the birds won't fucking shut up, so chances are you're gonna see me melt and then just cry. Are you serious? I'm in the top three of the class, you deliberately took my name off. Watch your tone, Ivory Lavender, or you will get smacked upside the head. You are speaking to your commanding officer. If you or any other cadet isn't ready, they will remain here and train harder. You being my daughter has nothing to do with this decision. It has everything. Class dismissed. Commander Ichabo, I assume preparations are complete for my immediate departure to Anu. All is prepared, General. Nice moonwalk, bro. In August, I start waking up at 5 a.m. Ew, that sounds lit. Ive, I'm sorry. 
Punch, I'm happy you got in. Whoops, alright, I don't know how I made it onto the list. I do, my father never lets me do anything. He thinks I can't handle it, but I'll show him. I'll show all of you. Yeah, he's really hard on you. Take my place, you deserve it. Punch, that's... I don't deserve you. Thanks so much. I don't deserve you. We boning, boys. We boning. Taika, let's head to the flight deck before anyone catches us. Items found. Flight clearance. Alright, hey man. Uh, excited about the scouting mission? I heard they're still struggling with the Groblin presence. Can oh, I grab this? No. These are some high quality firearms. Take them. Take them. Kill them. Uh, I got the stuff written up for you for the history exam. Alright. So we're a cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. I got a healing balm. Now I'm gonna read someone else's journal. I mean, alright. Uh, okay, cool. Can I, like, roll dot... Oh. Was that why? That was why. Items, abilities, equipment, tutorials. Alright. But I just do. Down, 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 down. Can I interact with this? Farewell, friend. Car. Take your time. See you later. And before I just ruin the game. I get killed at the end of the game because I freed the bird. This looks a bit rusty and old. Dude, same. That's why I have red in my beard. Uh, my flight clearance. Congratulations, Miss Lavender. Always do you get picked. Ha, <laughs> yeah. Um, so do you have a monoscout ready? All set, but where's your helmet? Uh, I left it in the other hangar. I'll be right back. Of course. We fitted new compressors on these model scouts. Never purred better. I wonder what happened to this model scout. Heard one got hit bad by lightning some moon runs ago. Okay. We've brought a man, Commander. No one saw us. Excellent, soldier. Make sure to double the guards on that cell. You'll learn a vice. Man, can I have your number? Ive, what on number are you up to? Hasn't your father taught you that it's rude to eavesdrop? I'm just getting my helmet, Commander. Right, of course. Forgive my harsh tone. Carry on, cadet. Do you think she heard us and our master plan? Don't get yourself into trouble now, cadet. I don't even know what trouble is. Ha, huh. please excuse us. You know what? You're excused, and I'm not your bra. Dun, 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 dun. They'll never suspect a thing. Carry on with your conversation. I'm not even here. All right. I want I want Mule there. All right. Ben, nah, 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 nah. The music's actually really good. I like it. I feel like the game's quiet, but maybe once we start like fighting for realsies, it's gonna get a lot of shit. Hello. You look ready now. Excellent, Miss Lavender. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's get you strapped in. Stay strapped. Always strapped, baby. The end. So Chris is playing, um... Never mind. What are you playing, Eternal? And Lightspeed, what are you playing now that you, uh... Stayed up all night to play as a Jack's X thing. I'm still so tempted to get Trailblazer. Someone convinced me not to. Man, I won't because I wanted it a lot. I want it, I want it too. A little Monster Slayers. Nice. How's that going? Good old mindless card clicking. You okay, Uncle? You're, that's your uncle? Yeah, just give me a moment. You should have stayed in bed. I can handle this. Ah, uh, nonsense. Just because I'm sick, I can't let you have all the fun. Uncle Benio. Don't worry, I'm on. Now we're here. The Zabirum Temple. Exciting. Isn't it nice not knowing what's next? Doesn't that make for the most exciting adventures, huh? Yeah, you've told me a thousand times. Now, why are we here? Haha, <laughs> you've got the patience of a toddler. Is your name Shiz? <laughs> I'm on. There's an uh, undiscovered artifact in the Zabirum Temple. Lady Evandu's tip. She has a tip too. I always play with just mine. Another one of Evandu's tips. She usually has good leads. Uh, yes, yes, she does. Let's head in. Alright, there's nothing there. So who the fuck am I now? Alright. Hello. <clears throat> this looks like that statue in Zaber. There are more of them. 
Yes, yes, there are many scattered all over the world. I believe these are known as collectibles, and they are the thing that Shiz hates the most in the world. Made by a group of nomads to show their people it was a safe place to save. Legends say they even have a secret magical property as well. Amazing. Guess we could catch our breath here for a minute before we go on. Sounds like a good idea. Alright, so there's the safe spots. Onusurai statue. Oh, oh no, it's Onurasi. Dude, I know how to read. <laughs> I went to school. <laughs> Bug. Give me the butt. Uh, I'm on. You have a bleh, thief stance and a blaster stance to get the job done. In your thief stance, you can steal items and and dealer. Is that money or something from enemies? Or you stab to deal piercing damage. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. Nightbot has been going ham lately. <clears throat> That's what the fifth time out since yesterday of like innocent stuff. Give me one second here. Spine protection. Excess caps. Let's disable that. But links are still uh, blocked light speed. Switch to the blaster sets to deliver powerful exploding elemental and non-elemental attacks. Your blaster uses spud ammo which can be found in the world or bought in shops, so remember to keep your ammo supplies topped up. Nothing worse than running out of spuds in the middle of battle. Have I told you about the time when? Come on, Uncle Benio, I can't wait to get this started. This treasure is not going to steal itself. Uh, spud blast or fire blast? Let's do spud blast. Noise. Ugh. Uh, Spud Blast. So he's like a hammerhead shark land thing. Oh, okay. Can I actually. Oh, that's cool. Interesting. That part ain't got time for your shit. It's true. It's true. So I like the fact that you could just stay in the stance that you want. Muba was too good for <laughs> Muba was too good to you for far too long. Nice. Oh man, chat. <sighs> Did you know that when you have a bad back and really terrible allergies, that mowing two lawns in an afternoon sucks balls. Yeah, okay, so Daler's gold. Daler. Also, before deciding on this, this has been a game I've wanted to play forever. Uh, before deciding on this, I was actually testing to see if my PC could run Guts and Glory, and unfortunately it didn't. I'd, or it got really hot really fast. Which sucks, because that would have been a really good stream. I could definitely make that one work. First strikey. Why is my guy hurt? He's been hurt this whole time. At least it's good to know that uh, you have to heal between fights. This is pretty. I'm really liking the art style so far. Z I, d I don't know how I want to pronounce this. Zabarum? Zabirum? Let's call it the Sibian Temple. <laughs> let's, uh, let's have a glance at the achievement list. First of all, does it track? It does. Leveled all characters to level 20. Ew. Uh, opened 50 chests. Completed the game. Defeated one of every enemy. Leveled every type of plant to level 3. Grew a plant in every garden slot. Crafted one of every perk talent, leveled up all bonds to level 5, equipped a talent in every available slot. I mean, first of all, how many achievements? 34. Okay. Uh, talent in every available slot. Released all the barnacles to play on the plumpet beach. I'm going to miss that for sure. Released 50 tormented ghosts. I'm going to miss that for sure. Gained gold rank in all tournaments. Planted one of every critter plant. Scavenged all scrap piles. Uh, dug up all treasure zones. Crafted one of every weapon. Unlocked all prison cells in Karba Prison, and then I guess these might be progression or what have you. Fuck, that's a lot. 
It really can't run Ghost and Glory. I don't understand how you even stream. Uh, yeah. It's weird. It's like... I, it doesn't mind having really good looking games running in 1080p 60 frames a second like Hellblade. It's fine. But as far as running a game... Uh, it's, I think it's I think it's literally just my graphics card being shit. But even at that, I don't understand how we could capture really good looking stuff and be fine. But as long as I can stream my Xbox, because that's my main focus, right? So. And then uh, Minecraft is fine. At one point last night it was getting a bit hot, but I think it was just when it, I was like running around a lot and a lot of shit was loading. But now, like I said, all I'm done, all, all I have to do really is uh, idle for hours. So when I'm just sitting there doing nothing, my PC is fine with it. So it's all gravy. Let's be thank you for the 31 biddies. Thanks for showing me your bits. Actually, I guess you're top cheer so far, yeah. Because the, the week just reset. Also, uh, as you guys know, today is going to be is supposed to be my day off, so I'm going to take tomorrow off instead. I just figured I would rather stream six and a half hours today than three and a half tomorrow. You ever consider getting a better graphics card if that is indeed the only issue? We'll open up a lot of game possibilities. Uh, number one, I don't know if it's the only issue. I, I assume it's that, but um, also, if I remember correctly, when I bought this PC... My buddy and the guy selling it to me were like, because uh, I said I don't game on PC, I just want to record, and they were like, alright, cool, it's fine for that, but if ever you do want to change the graphics card, you might need a bigger case, and most likely you'll need a bigger, power, uh, better power supply. So it'd be a whole fucking thing. Uh, this temple is beautiful, but how do we get inside? I was hoping this would do the trick. No, I think it was, I would need a better power supply, but that would need a bigger case. Something like that. Then he would need it to know if motherboard can handle it. Yeah. So I'm just like, whatever. I just can't game on PC, which yeah would give me some more options. But realistically, I play everything on Xbox anyways, right? So for the whole like one or two games I miss out on every few months, I'm like I'll live. Uh, was hoping this would do the trick. <clears throat> it's an old relic that belonged to your parents. It's called a cock ring. I tried it long ago. I'm counting on you having better luck than me. Ooh. Wow, what's it supposed to do? Well, let's see, it's a ring you put on your cock. Manipulate Amri. Try it on that Amri apparatus over there. Wonder if my 10 year old laptop can run the PC version of Hellblade? Uh, it'll probably explode as soon as you boot it, but I mean, you could try. I, that's one reason I never bought Minecraft, because I was like, Rivals of Ether is the only game that works. But, um, like I said, DDA sent me a code, so I was just like, alright, I'll try it. Worst case, I own it, and I could always, like, play it on a PC in the future or something. But somehow it runs fine. <clears throat> I left it, oh, today was funny. I let it idle for a couple hours. I, I let it idle for a couple of hours and monitored the heat of my PC and stuff, and it was fine. So I, I let it idle while I was mowing the lawn. Uh, the internet crapped out again. It's the second day in a row. So like we, we they just upgraded our internet two weeks ago. And um, the Wi-Fi was working, but my wired stuff, so my PC and my Xbox were not connected. It's two days in a row for, for some reason. It's like right at 11 a.m. Uh, around 11 a.m. they just crap out so I might have to phone them I reset the router again I'll see tomorrow if I come home if it's connected and whatnot but that was annoying and because of that uh, I think that's why my counter in Minecraft says I'm still at six hours in the game but then when I do the math of the achievement tracker it seems like I'm more around nine so I don't fucking know dude it's just annoying when all I could do right now in the game is idle that it doesn't work <clears throat> As like I said, I went ham yesterday. I got 85 out of 87 achievements. So on the Windows 10 version, you could just use achievement worlds and stuff. And I've already spent so many hours doing stuff legit that I was like, you know what? I'll cheese. I'll cheese. So I just have to make an iron golem, which uh, got broken by the aquatic update the other day. So whenever that gets patched, I'll, I'll get that. And then the other one is play 100 days. So 33.33 .33 hours. 
So now I have the 360 version completed, the 2.1 versions completed. I'll have the, the Windows 10 version completed, and I uh, I have it on uh, iOS. It's just like, look at the size of my screen compared to my hands. <laughs> you see where this causes issues. I have like a little iPhone 5 SE, and I'm a big bitch. Why is my battery showing yellow? I don't know. Phone fucks up more every day. That reminds me, I gotta, tonight after the stream, I gotta try to roll back to the last iOS version and see if that fixes my problem where um, nothing internet related works without Wi Fi. So usually I check my emails and Twitter and Instagram, what have you, while I'm on the bus or having a smoke or whatever. And uh, yeah, all my shit is broken. So it's been like a week where I basically, my phone is a waste of space. Because I don't really text or call people. Because uh, number one, fuck people. Number two, I'm always busy. So uh, yeah. But um, now that I have Windows version, well, I'll probably do. Also, I don't get Wi-Fi in my room because the the modem and router are downstairs and the the floor basically blocks the signal just in my room I'm in the dead zone so I would have to literally set up the world in my Windows 10 version walk to the kitchen sit down on my little ass phone pop a couple of achievements come back load something else reinvite myself it'd be a whole fucking thing but it'd be doable what the hell are you you're an enemy uh, fire blast. Would fire blast work on the stone dude? Oof. Um, let's do spud blast. Wow, fire actually did more, huh? Interesting. I guess I should have done a melee attack, but at this point. He's almost dead. I had that problem with the family house. The router was at the bottom left corner. The house in my room was on the top right. Exactly. So, um... Yeah. Oh, we're on the board, and that is... Okay. Sipian Seeker defeat the Temple Guardian. It's an odd achievement location, but okay. Some sort of ancient disc. What is it? Uh, no idea. Some ceremonial ornament? Yeah, perhaps. Well, excellent. Reckon we'll get a nice sum for it back at home. <laughs> Zaber. Oh, uh, my breath. Let's go home. Alright. Also, I was looking yesterday. Well, actually, because uh, we were talking about it in chat. There's like... Uh, either like Bluetooth controllers or whatever, but you could basically have an Xbox controller that works with an iPhone. And they're like 10 pounds or something. As in currency, not weight. I, I or there's there's tiny little controllers. I might get a controller for my for my phone and do it that way. I don't know. Uh, they found it. Report to her immediately. <laughs> I just remember having a lot of trouble doing anything because I couldn't see what I was doing. I feel like the thing that I just picked up, I would have had to go back and use to open. I don't know. Chat, what do you think of this game so far? I'm thinking this is really cool. I really like the world and the graphics, and I like that it's like turn-based fighting and puzzles and... I don't know. Fighting that Temple Guardian was the best. Hopefully this treasure will make us quite a bit. Yeah, hopefully. You've exhausted yourself. Just tired. I'll be okay. I'll make a big pot of funny medicine. That'll help me out. God damn, yeah, dude. Somebody come here and cut my nose off. I'm all like drugged up on fucking allergy pills and my body just not having it. No, Uncle, you stay. You need to rest. I'll gather some BBs. Uh, it'll be good for your heart. Okay, thank you. Just head out of town. They're in the Northwest Plains. Chad, I've lately had an itch to uh, replay Shyness, the Lightning Kingdom, and this game is not helping at all. Harriet makes some delicious Ninkasi potions, but when she's open, is anybody's guess. Oh, great. You stupid bitch. Oh, uh, hey, man. Ezra. 
If the Soviet Union Empire can't clean up the goblin problem in the desert, there likely won't be any further airships coming our way. Alright, so these are the seed things where I guess there was that achievement for planting all the seeds. So that's a form of collectible. Yay. Uh, you excited about the Festival of Magic then, Amon? Oh yes, aren't you? I'm hoping it'll be fun. Xaver hasn't had much fun lately after Miss Burncrest passed away. I, uh, I miss her place. Well, I think at least she would have appreciated her stage now becoming an arena. That lady? Oh, she'd love it. Never was a play of hers without a third act filled with fighting. Like, why did we have that conversation? Runcita, if that is your real name. Search dungeons to find chests as they could take any crafting materials, ammo, talents, recipes, potions. Oh, shit, okay. Uh, let's go back to Zaber. I'm not done ex explorinating. That's a really cool map thing. Let's see what's up here. So, girl, you steal to gain both money and rare crafting items. I could just flat out raw people? Oh, that guy's really got a lot on his mind. What is that? Okay. Guy's like doing Tai Chi at the fucking stairs. Alright, this is gonna be another collectible. Release all the crows. Although, to be fair, so far it didn't look like there's anything that's missable. So, because I said that, though, uh, you know. Also, I think I think this is like a 25 to 30 hour completion. Let's see if I go to howlongtobeat.com. Earthlock. Is it here? Earthlock. Main story. Meh. Main plus extra 30 hours. All styles 30 hours. It doesn't have a uh, main story time or a completionist time. But then Earthlock Festival of Magic, main story 13 hours, main plus extra 23 hours, completion is 25 hours, all styles 20 and a half hours. I don't know, I guess we'll play it by ear. If the game ends up being fucking amazing, we'll try to complete it. And if it's just another game, we'll focus on just trying to beat it. Uh, hi Amon, good to see you. There are piles of metal scattered all over Umbra. I feel like I'm the only one trying to do something about it. Could you help me by removing all the scrap metal to the northwest? Uh, talk. Uh, goodbye. Alright, so we got a quest. Listen, listen, I've seen strange folks around. Whoops, strange folks indeed. Yes, yeah, Sparks, sure. Don't you worry. You worry too much, you know? What the fuck is this, Monday streams? Yeah, I was home because of a holiday today, Cully. And, uh, finished all my shit outside early enough that I was like... I'd rather stream six and a half hours today than three and a half hours tomorrow. So I'm doing a long stream today and going to take tomorrow night off instead. How are you, man? Uh, Alright, so that's another seed thing. Uh, hello. I remember this game? Yeah, I have both versions and I never played it and don't know what it is. So far it seems cool though. Uh, there's glory to be found in the arena. It will be mine. How about you, Tai Chi Master? When does the tournament start? Patience, young man, will open shortly. Thanks for the info. Save current? Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, hello. Here we go. Healing Bomb, Spud Blast, Kiss of Lee, Resurrects a Fallen Ally, Treasure Map. Hmm. I have 14 healing bombs. You have 180G, dude. Impossible. Maybe there's something valuable worth taking a chance. What you think, chat? Never mind, I'm doing it. <laughs> doing it and doing it and doing it. Uh. Did I already speak to you? There is glory to be found in the arena, it'll be mine. Hello. Yeah, so that was you. Make medicine. Catch dozy BBs outside of Zaber. Uh, oh, we were just there. How do I go there? How do I go back? Or no, that I guess is complete. Right, the treasure is... Th okay, never mind. Gather scrap in the, in the northwest, and we have to help Uncle Benio while he rests. Okay. September 2016, so I don't remember shit. I wonder, was this the game that glitched on me? I think it was, Kali. 
So since then they came out with a new version, which apparently is like the how it was supposed to be version. Um, is this do I have, catch these? Okay, yeah, these are the dozy BBs. Um, yeah, apparently this is like the how it should have came out version. So I had the original from Games of Gold, and then because I owned it. Uh, when the new version came out, I was able to download this one for free. So basically, I got the two versions for free. No idea what the fucking game is. But it always interested me because I like the style and stuff. Uh, they threatened you. Yes, said there would be trouble if I was lying. Their hooded faces, they had this dark aura. It gave me the creeps. I'm worried about you, Benyo. Hmm, these are the dark moon runs. Can we still go ahead with everything? Yes, old friend, you can count on me. No, this is not Festival of Magic. This is the... It just It's just called Earthlock. I'll show you what it looks like. Festival of Magic is the uh, the OG. OG, triple OG. Uh, here it is. So that's Festival of Magic. The, like, big horn figure. And then this one with the, like, clouds around is the second version. As far as I know. I just did a little, uh... Looking around and all that. And that... This seems to be the new one. Uh, thank you, Vandu. Remember, keep the secret. I don't want to worry, Amon. Hey, Amon. Get it? <clears throat> Only Festival of Magic, and that's the one that glitched on me. I wonder if it's fixed, or if they didn't bother because they were making this version. It says on TA that you can't get it digital anymore. Yeah, it's delisted. They got rid of that, and they put out this version. Uh, worry about what? Hi, Lady Evandu. Amon, your uncle was just saying how well you have been looking after him. I just came to see how you two were doing. This old champ is in good hands thanks to you. We'll see you both soon. Thank you, Lady of Andu. Have a nice moon run. I got some real squirmy BBs, Uncle Benyo. I'll head upstairs and make some medicine. You relax. Thanks, Amon. This illness. I don't know what I'd do without you. Don't we? we you can tell we're related. I'm elated to be related to you, bruh. I'm sorry I didn't wish you happy birthday yesterday. I guess I'm a little belated. Uh, medicine is almost done. How are you feeling? Not so good. I think I overdid it a little this time. Dude, fucking same. Watching you fight today, though, made me realize something. Yes, you can't stay here your whole life. You need to go out and see the world. I, c I have something for you. I can help you grow as a scavenger. All right. You've done really well on our treasure hunts lately. I'm proud of you, Amon. Uh, thanks, Uncle. Here, let me give you some talents. You've earned it. They go on the talent board I gave you earlier. Now you can really own your skills. Use the talents on the board to improve your stats and abilities. Remember, you can apply new talents at any time. Thanks, man. I think I'll rest up now a proper nap. So is he gonna die, or...? Okay, what do we got here? Attack, defense, magic, magic, defense, accuracy, evasion, speed. It allows Amon to attack targets using stab. Amon can also gain items in Dalar by using steel. Uh, blaster, Blaster S. Super abilities from Blaster Science, okay? Welcome to the talent board. The talent board is used to upgrade the character by adding ability stat or perk talents to it. Ability talents. These talents provide new abilities for that character. Ability talents are specific to each character but can be swapped to other for other ability talents of that character. So, Adrenaline Rush applies both haste, 40% uh, speed stat, and evasion, 300% evasion stat. Ooh. Uh, so let's see. Enhances abilities that deal physical damage. Bonus. Increases effectiveness of magical abilities. So attack plus 12, magic plus 3. Uh, stat talents. The stat talent provides stat boost to characters and can be swapped between any character. Uh, perk talent provides passive abilities to characters and can be swapped between any characters. The origin talent is unique per character and is a source of power for the talents. All new talents must be connected to the origin talent to be active. Adding a new talent requires a talent point, and that talent is added next to an already active talent. Add the magic, uh, add the magic, add the mark target ability talent next to the origin talent. Uh, okay. Note that the attack stat talent has also become active because it is now next to an active talent. Enjoy building and customizing the characters. So. Ability is a ranged ability that lowers the target's defense against ranged attacks, and then this is enhances abilities. So I got plus 12 attack and plus 3 magic. Okay. 
cool, cool. That was a fucking convoluted way of saying it, but okay. I played Raging Justice earlier. How was that? I heard it's really hard. Uh, can you head up to Lady Avandu's and sell the artifact we found? Shoot me shop around a little first. Might get a better deal. Lady Avandu has been good to us, and I have a bad feeling about this thing. But your medicine is just getting more and more expensive. She'll give us a decent deal. Don't argue now. Okay, Uncle, but I think we could get more for it. Alright. You sleep well, Uncle, and please get better. Please. Huh. I don't know if it's very hard or not, it's very low frame rate and really bad hit detection. That sucks. Oh yeah, you need scrap metal. Uh, Lady Yvonne is her? No. Lady Yvonne was in the shop before it hits her. Hey dude! Hi, Lady Avandu. Me and Benio found this ancient disc. Oh, let me see. Hmm, intricate. Yes, yes. Hoping you could go to the high end, say $400? You know, let's go higher. $500. I know Benio's medicine has become costlier. Really? That would be great. Excuse my interruption. That artifact, sir, is old. Definitely from before the deadly halt. Oh, it's the dude from the thing. It would be worth a lot of us at the Great Archive, much more than $500. How much? Well, money is not an issue for the House of the Owl Tide. At least one thousand dollar, likely more. I'm on. No, wait. Sorry, Lea Lady Avandu, but I'm scavenger blood. This could really help Benyo. House of the Owl Tide. Yes, we just call, call it the Owl Tide. We run the Great Archive. You need the money for medicine, sir? Yes, my uncle Benyo is sick. There is, there is extensive knowledge on illnesses and remedies in the Great Archive. Perhaps we can find a cure for your uncle. Oh, you really think so? Is this archive near Zaber? I've never heard of it. Oh, no, it's in the capital, in Suvia. Wow, you came all the way from Suvia? Man, I would love to get a chance to go there. So why are you in Zaber? Nothing really ever happens here. Er, uh, well, Zaber is, how would you say, a little bit of a detour. I really need to get to Ramu. I am looking for someone there. That's some detour, but it's no problem to get there. I've been there several times with my uncle who just head north from here. Is it dangerous at all? That's what worries me. It can be, if you don't know the place. Who are you looking for? A mysterious warrior named Olia Alagbato. She's a seeking owl. Uh, okay, look, my uncle is sleeping now. I can take you there and we can talk about a cure for him. Oh, that's most kind, sir. I thank you. I help you, you help me. It's what we do here in Zaber. I'm Amon Barros. I am Nart's Tiger Moth, Hog Bunny, and Servant of High Owl Lady Lumia Risendale. Okay, I'm just a mod. <laughs> Great, I'll mark this down in my journal. I like to keep a record of my travels for reference. Nart joined the party. New tutorial unlocked. I finally reached Zaber. So much fascinating history seeping out of the sand and walls of this old town. I must remember the study of the old well before I return to Suvia. I don't regret leaving Suvia anymore, but I'm still thirsty. Now only find this uh, what only to find this Olia Alagbato woman, a stray owl. Lady Lumia claimed. Wonder if I'll ever hear why. Hopefully, Olia herself will be pleasant and chatty as we return to Suvia. Uh, I was told it would be nice and cool up here in the dirigible, dirigible, in the Digimon. Now the captain's laughing at me, telling me that's only for the high flyers, not the sand carvers, as he calls these low-flying airships. I'm down in my last bottle of water, and still all I see is the great burning desert stretching out in front of us, on both sides and behind us. I regret not taking the coastal route. On second thought, I even regret coming. The high owl could have been someone else instead. I'm no traveler, no adventurer. I belong in the candlelight and dusty books. I'm sad to leave Suvia behind, a funny statement coming from a hog bunny I know. We often reminisce about our wonderful Lango forest. I suspect it's not leaving the bustling streets, the plumes and scents of law merchants that makes me wistful, but the books and knowledge of the great archive that I will be away for, from for quite some time. Lady Lumia did promise it would be quite would be a swift mission, that I would return to Suvia shortly, but something in my belly tells me otherwise, and I don't mean the rumblings. Ha! Tutorials. Um... Bonds and supers. The super stance is the only accessible once the battle bond bar is fully charged, denoted by the blue bar between the pair's icons. Oh, I see. The bar can be filled by damaging enemies or supporting the party. 
Uh, in Super Sentence, the board is divided into segments corresponding to the level of bond between the characters. Bond XP is gained by completing battles together in pair. Try changing out the pairs to unlock more perks. Uh, on each new level of bond, a new perk is unlocked. At certain bond levels, a talent point will be gained. <sighs> so it's good to level all the bonds between the party. Alright. I remember Piggy was good in battles. Nice. And for food. <laughs> Achievement! Oh, is it? Alright, quest log. So we gotta go to Remove Swamp. And we've gotta gather scrap in the northwest. And then that's his log. Bestiary. Oh, okay. Look at this cute little thing. I can't believe I killed it. Strong against fire, weak against ice. Strong against none, weak against piercing and crushing. A temple guardian, although the Onur Onurasi have not admitted to the theory, it is recorded in the Alatide Archive that the Zabirum people desired a guardian of their temple city, one that would roam the grounds forever to protect them, and that an Onurasi custodian granted them their wish, raising the guardian from the stones themselves. So this beast here is pretty decent. I like the fact that there's one with pictures, because uh, that probably makes finding stuff you miss very easy. Uh, hey man. Is this open yet or what? When does the tournament start? Patience Young Man will open shortly. Alright. Let's GTFO out of here. You need shit in the northwest. You know what? Before we do that, let's just save. <clears throat> Chat, this is really cool so far. I'm digging it. Right, so she's open whenever. Mm. Sorry, I'm tired of shit. Uh, just so you know, I try to keep my map updated as best I can. I drop visited places and highlight known locations. Have a look. Perfect. Ooh. Uh... Okay. Turn to game. Now, how do I? Okay, so it's back, and that's just a full map. Okay, I can't. Uh... All right. All right, then. Am I... What? One second. I. What the hell is with my phone? Why is my battery yellow instead of green? I did something wrong. Did I do fucking, like, battery saving mode or something? Yep, I had low, low uh, power mode on. I don't know how I did that, but okay. Uh, why did I leave from that side instead of... Okay, I'm assuming that the yellow is my... See? Oh. Okay, I see. HP restored. Okay. I might as well just harvest these. Speed boost! What is this? Soviet Wars. Okay, this is how we get. Okay. Okay. Whoops. Uh, my mage stance, I could heal party members with regen. Could also use club to deal a little damage, but just a little. You know, I get a little nervous in combat, but if I enter my focus stance, I kind of forget what's happening. <sighs> well, in the focus stance, I could keep boosting the whole party. Thanks for sharing, Nart. Good to know we are a team. Oh yeah, you're weak as shit. Okay. Um. Let's try, uh, focus.
Ow. Interesting. So he's obviously a yeah, support character and all that. Um, uh, as we are in battle, as we are a battle pair, I feel there's a battle bond between us. Every time we attack the enemy or help each other, I feel the battle bond grow. When the battle bond is fully charged, we can activate our super stances. I can't wait to unleash the power of my super blaster. S. Okay. How is it that I got enhanced attack, but then I was doing less damage? Anyways. I'm just gonna mash it on these little nerds. Right, he could just stay in that stance. That's super dope. Uh, the super carries over from battle to battle. That's awesome. That's awesome. Chat, sorry, I'm just not realizing that I'm super beat. Uh. Uh, Alright. Well, it would be better if you could just tap it, but... I guess I get it. Um, chat, is the audio good? It, I feel like some of those sound effects are super loud. Old ass? Yeah. Well, to be fair, I went to bed at like 4 or 5 the past couple of days. Then, yeah, I was outside all day and shit, so I'm just nice and broken. I, f I feel like those s sound effects are distorted. Sounds decent? Alright. Alright, let's try this special. Our battle bond is fully charged. Can I use my blaster as stance now? Yes, when you activate the battle bond, you will see it divided into a super segment. The number of super segments is related to our bond level. The higher the bond level, the more segments we will have. Press left bumper and take them out, I'm on. Oh, nice. They're somehow not dead. Okay. We're gonna have to heal after this fight. I should have used regen. Oh well. It's K. Okay. So we got Fang and Fine Wing. Cronkillium. Music is super dope. Son of a bitch. Let me just get that uh, that metal before we move on. I'm gonna stick to the left, I think. Yeah. Okay. So, Kali, you got the 1K in Boss 101? That game was so good. Completed it eventually. Nice. Man, Ray had a shitty glitch happen to him yesterday. So, uh, yeah, I saw your tweets, uh, Cully. I guess I just got lucky that I was speaking to them between levels. Um, so Homeless Messiah had it so that he didn't. Whoops. Um, Messiah had to redo the game to get the achievement for unlocking all guns. I'll be back, homie. And uh, Ray ha has one achievement left, which is to see everything in the tutorial. That one bugged out on him. So that really sucks.
So I got nothing from that. I also just realized that the right stick actually does something. All right. Talk to everybody between each stage to avoid it. Exactly. Exactly. Right, I forgot to heal. Ooh, baby. There, well, there's a... Um, between levels, next to the professor, on the right side there'll be a visitor. So that's the person that you have to speak to between levels. Poisoned. Nice. I wonder if I could just heal him or if I need a cure potion or... So the quest log was get to Ramu Swamp. Gather strat. Oh man, we're at 5 out of 20 scraps. Rip. Alright, we got him. Okay, what's up fam? Uh, oh no. That thing has a lot of health. Play the game three times. Yeesh. Well, to be fair, I did most of a second playthrough for medals and whatever and collectibles. Did that last night. That's crazy. Hey man, at least you did it right. Um, let's do this. So now we're at like 7 out of 20 scrap. I'll keep going this way. Try to get some scrap and um, try to find the swamp and whatnot. Rip. Rip. Noise. Noise. So he's level three, the other one's still level two. <laughs> That's cool. Die kids, scribing tool, scrap, electro core. If I knew I could have saved at least at least five hours that much. Jesus. That's pretty rough. Be a level talk to visitor if it doesn't say pet unlock play the level again. Yeah, I would I would say don't bother. 
There's not a guaranteed one every level either. Yeah, and you're gonna want to replay levels for collectibles and for medals and stuff. So I'd say at least your first playthrough, don't sweat anything. Just like beat a level, talk to the visitor, and move on. Oof. Keep forgetting that I got burnt here and here. My skin, I think my skin is like permanently fucked there. Especially here. Because even when there's no sun, it looks scarred. I think it's literally from getting burnt too bad in the past. But uh, I was dumb and didn't put sunscreen, so rip me. The issue mostly is that there's no way to tell which, you, which level you are missing. Yeah, exactly. It's uh, typically the case. Unless you keep track of it yourself, I guess, yeah. At least it's easy to keep track of the collectibles and the dolphins and the escort and all that. How could you keep track? There's no list of which ones you get per level anywhere? No, well, if you beat level... Uh, if you beat level 2 and get a pet, you could write down <laughs> level 2. Or write down if it doesn't give you one, yeah? One or the other? Write down what exactly? Places that I got pets, level 2. Places I didn't get pets, level 2. And that way you know which levels to go back to. So if you got one on level 2, you, you might not have to go back to that one. This shit is so chill, my dudes. So very chill. Got four different pets on level two. I was just giving you an example, bro. Oh, some are multiple? Then that's just bullshit then? Cool. So if you're avoiding level two because you got one pet, you'll probably miss it. Rip. Yeah, I got. I guess I got super lucky. My uh, last one was on level one. I literally just replayed levels until I got that. I just kept replaying level one. Based on the visitors you get, and different levels have different percent chance of certain visitors. Fair enough. When I needed, the dev said, level 26 is highest chance, but 27, 28, and 29 also have a smaller chance. Okay. Interesting. Oh, it's so chill and just so good. Sounds awful. Why would that even be a mechanic? That's a good question. Because while the game is great, I agree that that is uh, pretty stupid. I would have loved to be able to track it somehow. Yeah. Yeah, that would have been dope. Sounds so distorted. So these all respond. No. Well, I just said what I suggested work for her. Yeah. So how many visitors' pets are there? Uh, thirty-four pets. 
Yeah. Level's 31. I was only missing two at the end and I got them by replaying one and two. One thing I noticed is when, um... It seemed like they, it would tell you at the bottom left when there was a new visitor, no? And I feel like they, they come to the command center the first time, but maybe I, I don't know. I could be not remembering it properly. <clears throat> it's not a new visitor though, that's a problem? Okay. I honestly, it's been, I know it's only been a week, but I, I don't remember just because they didn't give me any trouble, uh, troubles or problems. This game's a bit framey. Also, this fighting is already getting boring. I'm just doing it to level up and shit, but I'm sure I could skip this if I really wanted to. Oh. Let's do, uh... Nice. So that was his super. Yeah, exactly. Click the visitor after each level, and that's that's the best thing to do. And besides that, I would say just focus on beating the game to start. <clears throat> the game is much easier and more simple. Um, afterwards, after you beat it, you could go back and just murder the part times and whatever when you're uh, more leveled up. Am I? I'm right where I need to be. I don't understand. Am I supposed to? Oh. Oh, this is the place, Ramu, is like, that tower, okay. I forget that the, the cities are like, the size of your hand. Ramu. Will there be any Ramu-fications? <laughs> Look at all the sunken marvels around us, Amon. I'd sure love to know the history of this place. I'm making a mental note for my return to the Great Archive. Nart, you must find books on the subject of Ramu. Cheek. I just can't wait to read about its mysteries, secrets. Uh, not to dampen your mood, but Mr. Tiger Moth, but this woman you were supposed to deliver the message to. Yes, yes, Miss Alec Bato. With my luck, she's probably deep inside the smelly swamp. Doesn't smell that bad. Oh, you think maybe my nose is too sensitive? I think you are too sensitive. And I think you smell a bit, actually. Okay. Sensible chuckle. So there's, I'm trying to think of, there's open every chest, there's probably to get every crow, plant every seed. Scholar Lucia. Hello Seeking Owl, I am Giant, Giant, Nart Tiger Moth. We are on a mission from the nest, can you assist Miss? Miss Lucia Thornclaw, and of course Mr. Tiger Moth, what can I do for you? We are seeking a woman, Olia Alagbato. Uh, I'm afraid I have not met anyone with that name, dear Hog Bunny, but if I run into her, I will be sure to mention you are looking for her. Oh, well thank you. These are the ruins of Brooker's Den, right? Yes, this is what's left of the old pirate nest. I am here to, met to experience the place for my next writing project. I was hoping to find the lost books from Brooker's library in the Frogmire Mansion, which lies deeper in the swamp. Unfortunately, the mansion is full of Drugo pirates and is far too dangerous for me to enter. Can you help? Well, real pirates? Yeah, we're happy to help. Uh, are, are we, I mean, pirates? Bam, bam, bam. Are we fighting the frog? Just got a welcome to the chat room message. Yeah, I had that the past couple days. They just randomly uh, give me that in chat. Anyone has Rainbow Six Siege? Quite a few achievements popped now with the new update. 
It's free for the next few hours, I think. Just click visitor after each. Oh, yeah. Uh. What about siege? How does that make sense? Is it just bugged and the achievements unlocked for no reason? Just not bug, they just unlock a ton of stuff now. Weird. Can I interact with these frogs? Nope. I love this running animation. First strike. So, this is actually. We're reminding me of shyness in the sense of I don't like the fighting but the rest is really cool um, except for shyness the fighting was just really hard this is just fucking boring right now it's a what a free weekend or the last day of a free weekend I assume fight through the pain so open early and got unlock all operators unlock all 20 original operators customize weapon unlock 50 achievements really depends on what you unlocked already that's so weird Sweet. Well, I already perfected it, so. Whatevs. But that's really cool. Okay. Hey, man. Holy mother of soil, that thing is huge. Keep your socks on. Watch out. You're going down, chomp for time to cut you down to size. But Warrior Stance gives me access to slashing and piercing attacks. As you already know, plants are weak to slashing damage. Never met an enemy that is not weak to a specific attack type or strategy. In my veteran stance, I can taunt enemies, forcing them to attack me. As a veteran, I'll counterattack every melee attack against me automatically. When I encounter tough melee enemies, I like to counter them back to Oblivion, my most powerful attack. Jeez, I'm glad you found us when you did. Um... Okay, that's what it is. Okay, slashing strike. Shit. Uh, he is going to heal. As will he. That was a pretty decent chunk. This isn't Tony Hawk. <laughs> What's up, Mac? How you doing, man? Tony Hawk. Crazy bastard. Got him. I'm going for that thousand baby. Dude, good luck. Fools, you're lucky I heard you or you'd be slimy ooze by now. Hey, I'm a desert scavenger. I could hold my own. You're far from the hot sands now, youngster. Ha, who are you to talk? Don't exactly look like you belong here. I'm Olia Alagbato. I belong everywhere and nowhere. 
Miss Alec Battle, we've been looking for you. I am Nart Targamoth from Lyango Forest. Well, no, I mean from Suvia, and I have an urgent message from High Owl Lady Lu. Okay. You'll have to wait. I must deal with the threat to the custodian. Custodian? We can help. You, a scavenger, and a hog bunny? I doubt it. Bring on the danger, and you'll see. <laughs> uh, do I get a say in this? Huh, I guess you're alright as decoys. Come along. Dude, fucking got him. Oh, yeah, join the party. New tutorial unlocked. What is this? Is this the emblem of the mythic Onu Razi people? Yes. Cool, good talk. What do you know of them? They live there? Uh, they did. Now the custodian watches over Frogmire. Where the Onu Razi's ancient tree rests. If you two stop talking, we could hurry up and get there. Man, she is no fucking around. Let me just see something. Are the birds still going crazy? From what I can hear, there's nothing outside. So let me just crack my window so I can actually breathe. That reminds me, actually, Messiah. Does this work? Do I have it enabled? Nope. I'm gonna have to fix that later. Um. Oh. So I could go in here? No? Can I? Hello? Oh. No? The fuck? All right, all right. Whoops. Um, do I go further this side? I guess so. Maka, how you doing, by the way? Besides contemplating uh, playing Tony Hawk, well, that didn't go well. Fucking bitch. All right, well, I think I have hours of grinding left in it. Yeah, I remember you mentioning last night that it's pretty much just grinding and shit. You have just you have the the hard stuff done and some manual too. <sighs> Son of a bitch! Glanced, glanced Armstrong. Okay, uh, can I? Eh, I want the chest. Give me the chest. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Man, this fighting is fucking boring, dude. dude don't spit on me, I'm a girl. The girl is supposed to spit on the guy. <laughs> Okay, what's in here? Healing bombs, a crank, an electric core, and a secret what song bowl? Are we blazing in bowls, bro? Girls like it when never mind. Nice. Uh uh. One crank was removed from inventory. Check it out, I'm Jason Statham. I like everything about this game besides the fighting so far. So like I said, trying to the Lightning Kingdom all over again. Cool environment, cool graphics, cool story, cool everything, and then you fight it and it's either annoying or boring. Bye. Ramu Villa. Wow, what happened here? Uh, Ramu once belonged to the frogs, the Drugos, and all other things, other beings of the swamp. Then came pirates. They corrupted it and built Brooker's Den. The Suvian fleet caught one of the pirates and bombarded the town to bits, leaving the swamp to eat the rest. Brooker's Den, the ther Thermos Brooker, oh great, lice, lice, li li lizards, I cannot wait to get back to study all this in the archive, I'll tell you everything I find, I'm on, I bet you will, Nart, I bet you will, 
This is the custodian's villa. Varlurk Drew and his band of Drugos will pay for breaking the treaty. That's a hard fucking sentence to read. Uh, band of Drugos? What if I just stay here and uh, we live through it and deliver your message, Hog Bunny? No time to lose. Okay. The books say Termus Brooker was deeply fascinated by the legends of old. This looks to be a commission statue depicting a vulver. They supposedly looked like that. <laughs> if you read all the fables and rumors and parchments and books, you'll find they looked like anything. Yo, girl, let me touch your vulver. All right, um. So, Punisher door. This is the door to the tree. I bet the custodian is in there. Okay. I can't jump this. Look at my legs. All right. Oh, I can actually gotta find a key somehow. Okay. Uh, let's save. The music's so spooky, man. Spooky music. There's all kinds of weird sounds. There's a frog jumping around and shit, man. I got two fine cloths. I just got. A, uh, I just stole a book. Nice painting, dude. No, I'm not interested in that. I don't even know what it was. Spud Blast. <clears throat> nice. Are you a bad guy? Yep. Spelled clothes? Hmm? What you talking, bro? Get stabbed. Ooh. Drew go chop. Why does this fucker get two turns? Cuck. Got him. Uh, can I steal anything? Maybe a, a bloody hatchet. It's locked. Of course it is. How very video gamey of you. Uh, now, what the fuck am I gonna do? Uh, did I just get a key? I honestly, I didn't notice. did I not see? Oh, wait. Wait, what the fuck? Was that, that just dude res just that dude respawning? Yeah, it was. Okay. Um, okay, I just had to leave by the top door. I'm dumb. My favorite part of this game is that Shiz played it. Thanks, man. I, uh, I still don't know what I think of it so far. Like I said, the combat is really fucking boring and there's so much of it, so... I don't know if, uh, if I'll stop soon and switch games or if I'll keep going. I really do not know yet. So many enemies, dude. Oh, he has a pirate hat? You know he means business. Yeah, I'm so tired. I'm wondering if I made a mistake by streaming today and should have taken a day off. I'm kind of tempted to just fucking go nap. Again, this boring ass fighting is not helping. Um... I got lost book. Yeah, that's gonna help open that door. 
Engage enemy, of course. And everybody needs potions like a motherfucker. You know what? No regrets. Let's just, uh... I want to see her super, actually. Um... So he's got the blaster, and the stab, and shit. Here. Oh, she doesn't have a bond? It's just doesn't have a bond? Uh... Uh... Uh, you know what? Let's let's heal them. Let's use healing bomb plus. Jesus Christ, dude. Okay. So he rummages through shit. He does plants and she yells? They did actually fix some of the major problems with Tony Hawk, like it's not good. But it's not as bad as it was. Nice. Well that's good at least. That's some good shit man, that's some good shit. Can actually restart an event in five seconds now instead of thirty. Wow. Wow. Man, get that one K. <clears throat> My next completion actually it won't even be Minecraft because there's that fucking that bug that she in now. But all I gotta do is idle. Idle a whole bunch and then that's done. And I don't know what else is my next completion. I have so many games that I'm yet to start that are short or somewhere I'm just missing a bit like like Tesla versus Lovecraft. I'm at 910 gamer score. I just have to beat the second half of the last map, but it's just hard. God, there's so much fighting. You already complete me? Thanks, man. So, um... Did you ever find out after last night, Mecca? Does Bruno Mars is gay? And also, did you check those descriptions? Shout out to Murphy. You ever check out the, the descriptions of those two videos? Dude, poor Ched. I'll point to unlock the certain levels of bond. Alright, we got small cogs. Dude, same. I mean, uh, inspect. It's blocked. I mean, it's not blocked, it's just water. What are you, a dumb? You have no past and future, you stupid cock. Dude, it's so good. That video is so weird. That video in game. Man, it sucks that my PC wouldn't run uh, Guts and Glory properly. That would have been a really good stream today. Hmm. Why are you killing chickens? Because fuck you. The game's only 99 cents. The budget was probably spent on the description. Oh, okay. Oh, good. More fighting. Can we? Alright. Dude, I'm taking so much damage from these little fuckers. Oh, right, I could just use my. Well, I don't want to use my special on one guy. Seems like a waste. <laughs> right, right, right. I wonder, does it track collectibles? Let's see. Uh, no. Uh, open 50 chests? How am I at 1%? I've opened at least 10. Dude, that's quick maths. Do I have a key? I guess I picked up a key at some point. Alright, 
Cool. Uh, hello. What the fuck? Uh, hello, buddy? In cage that has a frog mask on? Oh, not the tree. Whoa, what is that? I mean, it's... It's, it's, it's a tree. Great soil. I believe that's an Omri Spring. So much more majestic than the descriptions led me to believe. That's a frogmire tree. Surely the reason why Varalook is here. Hey, man. Are you Varlook? Throw down your weapons, Varlook. Ah, the red haired woman. I expected you earlier. Take your warband and return to the rugged marshlands. R leave Frogmire to its custodian. Do this and I will let you live. Frogboil will get you down. Kick him in the nuts, holy huh? Kick him in the nuts. Pa, you're in the swamps now, frail human. In my swamps. A drool chief does what he wants. For money? Who hired you? Enough talk, I'm starving. Then eat my blade. Dude. Sweet. I'm on. Nart, we need to watch ourselves here. Varlook is a fearsome opponent, but trust me when I say we can defeat him. In my experience, every enemy I have faced has a weakness. Like opening a lock, you use the key and not a hammer. The key and hammer both work, but one requires a lot more work than the other. Exactly, Nart. In battle, you must watch your opponent's moves and think what party members can counter or neutralize them. An inflexible battle strategy will get you killed far more often than a tough opponent. In battle, sometimes one person is the key and sometimes it's the party working together in a specific configuration, but the key is flexibility. Alright, I am ready, Olya. Let's do this, and let's end this tutorial segment of dialogue. Uh, let's do this. Get rid of his little crony first. Well, that's my first casualty. Let's try steel. Got him. Uh, somehow just like rob the boss. Let's try Stabbing Strike. Oh shit. Okay. So everybody's dead. That's fine. I'm bored of this game. Uh, the combat is not for me and there's just so much of it, but it's so... It's so boring. So, what we are going to do is we are going to unpin you. And we are going to uninstall you. Because that just is not my jam. I really don't feel like doing that for 30 hours at all. Which is a shame, because uh, it seems like a pretty cool game, but yeah, that fighting is fucking boring.